Hi, I'm Molly from Doodle. Today we're learning how to read simple fractions. Let's get started. As a reminder, a fraction is a part of a whole. One half is the same as one out of two parts. First, let's connect what we already know, which will help us with the rest of this lesson. We're going to do that by choosing the two shapes that show one quarter shaded. One quarter means that one out of four equal parts have been shaded. We can see that this circle has been split into four equal parts and one part has been shaded, so we know that it shows one quarter. This circle has been split into five equal parts with two parts shaded, so we know that it does not show one quarter. This bar has been split into four equal parts with one part shaded, so we know that this must also show one quarter. Excellent! We've earned our first doodle star of the lesson. Now we've recapped what a fraction shaded looks like, we're ready to discover our new learning of how to read simple fractions. Lena says fractions can be written using words or numbers. I know that one half is written as one over two. We are asked to shade one half of the whole shape. We know that one half means one out of two equal parts shaded. So we need to shade one part of this shape. Let's check. Excellent, that's another doodle star. Lena says one quarter is one out of four equal parts. We saw this during the connect section. We know that one quarter is the same as one out of four equal parts shaded. We need to complete the fraction that represents the shaded part of the shape. The top number in a fraction shows how many parts have been shaded. The bottom number in a fraction shows how many parts there are in total. We can see that there are one, two, three, four parts in total. So the bottom number of the fraction must be four. Great work! One out of three parts of this shape have been shaded. This shows one third. Again, we are asked to complete the fraction to show the shaded part. One part has been shaded and there are one, two, three parts all together. So we know that one third is written as one over three. We're doing brilliantly so far. Now, let's explore a final example by shading a fraction and deciding how to write it. Lena says three quarters is three out of four equal parts. We need to shade this shape to show three quarters. Lena has reminded us that three quarters is the same as three out of four equal parts. We can see that there are one, two, three, four parts in total and we know that we need to shade one, two, three to show three quarters. Let's check that. Great job! The final part of this lesson asks us to choose the fraction that shows three quarters. We have four options to choose from here. Which one do you think shows three quarters? When you're ready, take a look at the description box to see what the answer is. If you enjoyed this video and would like to try some questions, create an account to try Doodle Maths for free. Visit doodlelearning.com or click the link in the description box below to get started. For more maths guides, like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching!